1,700 meters above sea level, a flora and fauna with no equal and wind conditions never before encountered. That's how one could summarize Huntalm in Austria's Styria province. 13 wind power systems are supposed to be built on this treeless ridge. One prerequisite for this project is sensitivity towards the fauna as well as mountain pastures and forested areas. Only by meeting more than 100 environmental requirements to protect fauna and flora did the project get its approval. The official start of the project was in April 2017. Three large cranes with load capacities of up to 750 tons served as the main players. One self-propelled modular transporter as well as blade lifters to transport the rotor blades from the storage area to site. However, the just-in-time deliveries to the transshipment site, 1,400 meters above sea level, were already challenging. The components had been transported there more than 1,300 kilometers from Germany. Special vehicles such as blade trainers, tower lifters and multiple telescoping semi-flatbed trainers carried out a total of 208 journeys. Adding to the challenges of long-distance transport were the much greater struggles of mountain transport to the Huntalm site. The first two kilometers after the transshipment site actually went relatively smoothly. After turning into unpaved terrain, however, man and machine were tested to their limits. Tight corner radii, gradients of up to 20% and temporary road lined with trees allowed no mistake. Thanks to a blade lifter which allowed the positioning of the approximately 40 meter long and 10 ton rotor blade upright, the team managed to deal with the tightest minimum clearance outlines. One tractor and pusher machine each provided the necessary traction. A self-propelled modular transporter and heavy haulage axle lines with tractor units were used for transporting the other components. One week had been scheduled for the erection of one system. Within this period, five tower segments, the engine house with hub and stator, as well as three rotor blades were to be lifted into place. Changeable weather and strong winds, however, often thwarted the plan. In late September, the project was completed and the last rotor blade was successfully lifted into place and attached to the hub 78 meters above ground.
Thus, the 13 systems could be connected to the grid in late 2017. With rotor blade diameters of 82 meters, they are now ready to produce renewable energy, supplying some 21,000 households. A technological success in harmony with nature. Felbermeyer. Power in motion.